Welcome back to Soccer News Center. In today's video, we're diving into the Women's World Cup and discussing the potential return of Australian superstar Sam Kerr. The Australian coach, Tony Gustafson, has made it clear that if Sam Kerr is fit, she's starting for the Matildas in their quarter-final against France. There's no question about it. Kerr's talent and impact on the field are undeniable, and the team knows it. But here's the catch, Kerr's fitness is still a question mark. She has only played 10 minutes in the tournament so far due to a calf injury. It's been a frustrating time for her, sitting on the sidelines while her teammates have been excelling without her. Now, some may wonder if Kerr's return will disrupt the team's rhythm. After all, they've won three games and scored nine goals without her. But Gustafsson is quick to dismiss any concerns. He sees Kerr as a valuable asset, not a disturbance. Reintegrating Kerr into the lineup would mean making some tough decisions, possibly dropping players like Mary Fowler or Emily Van Egmond who have been performing exceptionally well in Kerr's absence. But Gustafsson believes that no matter the lineup, the team will adapt and continue their pursuit of a maiden World Cup semi-final appearance. One interesting fact is that the Matildas have used the fewest players in the tournament so far, only 17 out of 23. This focus on a core group of players can bring success, but it also raises concerns about fitness and fatigue. However, Gustafsson is confident in the team's fitness levels, describing them as extremely fit. But it's not just physical fitness that matters. Team harmony and managing the emotions and expectations of players who haven't seen much playing time is crucial. And Gustafsson couldn't be happier with his players' attitudes. They've been amazing teammates, supporting each other without complaints, whether starting or coming off the bench. So, as we eagerly await the quarterfinal clash between Australia and France, the big question remains, will Sam Kerr be fit to start? If she is, there's no doubt she'll make a significant impact on the game. But if not, the Matildas have shown that they can adapt and excel without her. That's all for today's update on the Women's World Cup. Make sure to like and subscribe to our channel for more football news. And as always, leave your thoughts and predictions in the comments below. Until next time, this is Soccer News Center, signing off.